Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my Bradford City versus Stockport County match vlog. If you do want to enjoy today's video, please make sure to drop a like on there for me. If you could try and hit 150 likes on today's video, that'd be massively appreciated. Subscribe if you are new as well. We're on the road to 8,000 subscribers, so please make sure you are subscribed if you haven't already with that post notification bell on. It's free to do so and it does massively help out. Drop a comment then as well down in the comment section down below. Let me know your thoughts on today's game. Now it's going to be our toughest test of the season so far. Stop Potter, a really, really good side, lots of quality in their squad. Yes, they've got some major injuries at this moment in time, but they've lost their th first three matches of the season. It's probably a good time to play Stockport, to be honest with you, with players like Crowsdale, Wotton, among with a, no a number of other players out injured at this moment in time. I've got both my score predictions right in the league so far, so hopefully it doesn't come right today, because I'm unfortunately going to predict a 1-0 defeat. I think going forward we look okay, but defensively we do look still a little bit shaky. There's no real pace in that back three, so I think we could certainly get caught out by that when they've got such pacey players like you know Louis Barry and players like that but fingers crossed we can get the three points make sure to drop a like on there for me subscribe if you're new as well and I shall see you all once team news is out here we have it then, here's how we line up for today's game away at Stockport County. One change from Saturday, as expected, Tyler Smith comes in for Jamie Walker. He was a doubt after the game and Mike Hughes has clearly confirmed here that he is unfortunately injured. Bobby Poynton comes onto the bench though, great to see him get an opportunity hopefully today. It's a strong team, still a bit slow in that back three, hopefully we play a little bit deeper today so we don't get caught out by that ball in behind, but apart from that, pretty impressed. <laughs> Stockport must have messed up somewhere because this was meant to have sold out a week ago and there's a good 100, 200 seats available. I don't know what's going on there. Oh, here we go. Whoa! Super Louis. Harry Lewis in goal! Lewis! 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 We slip and slide as we fall in love and I just can't seem to get enough fun. Bradford City, Mark Hughes, Bradford Army, Mark Hughes, Bradford Army, Mark Hughes, Bradford Army. This is why we need some pace in the defence. They're all too similar. Oh. Fucking hell, man. What the fuck are you two doing? Right now, that's certainly just goals in the slow in the second half. 
certainly not a bad performance though. Half time substitution. Kill head off. Right out gone. It's got to be some sort of injury because I can't think that'll be performance based. Just thinking about that Gilead decision could have been because he's on a yellow card. And this referee seems um, very card happy. <laughs> sat back for the last 20 minutes, we don't deserve anything less. Change of the game, Smith off for Matt Darbyshire. Smallwood's been our best player today and he's subbed off for us at eBay, who offers absolutely nothing. Why is Smallwood coming off? He's given offside for someone. 
going on with him? What the f*** has happened to Andy Cook? What has happened to him, man? What the f***? What the f*** has happened to him? Get out, get out. What the f*** shit? Just leave. No, he's not in there. I've never seen him. There's full time, frustrating man. Cooks had two big chances there, but on the balance of play, I don't think we really deserve to win the match, to be honest. Good luck, stop pop for the rest of the season. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And the Andy Cook gets the ball, he scores a goal. And the Andy Cook. He might be in a rough patch at the moment, but we still love him. He'll come good again.